Eek, you jumped all over it. What's not to love? You've got this it. bouquet. It looks like beautiful flowers. It looks like fireworks, an explosion of gorgeous confetti and color. And that is circling, haloing, framing that genuine hand-carved cameo. Mm -hmm. Just the size of that cameo, too, at 12 millimeters. Think about this. Somebody sit, sat there and carve this. I know that I would need my reader glasses to go ahead and carve that incredible detail, but then that spray of bezel set crystals in the most saturated, beautiful colors. This ring makes me happy. It's like, it's like confetti, it's like fireworks, it's like jelly beans. I, I'm, I was, I, yeah, so Leslie and I arrived obviously many hours ago for this show and went back and we had four hours of, of items that we're looking at. We, we, we both had we met both and spoken it. about it. Yep. We both picked this. I mean, a, a, and you cannot make a bad choice. You're looking at this and saying, well, that's all well and good. That's not my style. And that's absolutely fine. That's the beauty of a show like this. You can pick and choose. Jewelry is an extension of your style and your taste. But as soon as I saw this, and remember, I've been doing this for over 16 years. Jewelry, gems, gemstones are in fact my background. I looked at this and I was just like, Without it, without hesitation. Both of us. We, yeah. Yeah. Look at this. I want to show you the brooch. If I spin this around, because it is a pendant, right? So you Isn't have nice? you have the bail. One more. So and, I, and I'm going to say that's quite a substantial bail. Even maybe a, a slider collier could fit through there. But then this is what I was saying earlier: is that if you've got a scarf, a hat, a jacket that you've worn season after season, you think, you know what? I think it's probably time for a change. Maybe a simple touch. And let's be honest, this is nothing simple about this. But by adding this and putting you this on the breathe on the new life, breathe whole new life into yes, it. I Look agree. at the the setting charge alone for the crystals into those bezel setting, the setting charge alone wouldn't even equate to what we have here. I would have to. $59.90, yeah. not to mention 100%. a hand-carved Italian cameo in the center. And you know, for me, when I see somebody wearing a cameo, it says so much about that person. It says that person has the most discerning taste. Yes. It says that person knows about jewelry. Right. They know about art history. Not everybody in the world wears cameos. Not everybody in the world adores them. That's true, we get that. But the truth is, if you love art, if you love history, if you're fascinated by, you know, those times when, you know, I mean, when all that romance existed, it was a harder time. I mean, I, this is what you're wearing here today. It is a work of art. I love that Amadeo has said it in the most beautiful way so I can wear it as a pendant I can wear it as a brooch some of the most powerful women in the world love to wear brooches it's just another uh, unexpected way to adorn yourself and wear jewelry that spray of gorgeous colorful crystals I mean these look like genuine peridots and amethyst and rhodolite in there and blue topaz it looks like genuine gemstones haloing that giant beautiful cameo all hand carved for you, antique finish. So there is a modern sense to this. There's a modern freshness to this than, you know, grandma's cameo. Don't you agree? Oh, I, I it is spellbound. You, I look at the gemstones as first, okay? The crystals, the colors that are in there, the purples, the greens, the blues, the golds, the silvers, these, the, oh, and, and variations in the blue, that to start with, but your eye is drawn in. And then you get to see, you think, hang on, this is, this is a work of art, not just in the cameo, but then the frame of it. And you can have the most beautiful work of art in the world, but then you must frame it correctly. And that's exactly what they've done here. Sure. No two cameos will be alike. You, if we had every single one of the, the few that we had remaining out here on the set right now, there'll be a slight difference in the maiden, whether it be the, uh, a ringlet of hair, whether it be the flower and the way the petal was formed. That's true. But Andre, every I'll hold it close. Right? Come in as close as possible. I, I promise to stand still. But Jeff said it. The ringlets in the hair. Look the at little it. flowers Look at the in her detail. Hair. This is not some ghostly figure. From her eyelid to the, you know, the curve of her nose to her soft little smile. I mean, this is extraordinary. And if you've never owned a cameo and you do love jewelry, you owe yourself to have this as part of your collection. You know, I consider myself a jewelry collector. When I see something of this size, uh, you know, just for the cameo itself, this is a right. big deal because you you are now, it's like you own uh, you own a gallery. You own a real work of art. In, in my years, I've been very privileged to, to have shown some Italian lines down in Australia and one of which I can, I can promise you never in my time has shown such extraordinary value. I don't, and I don't want to cheapen the presentation by talking about that, but you have got genuine works of heart, hand-carved in the Toro del Greco, one of the most legendary eras 
areas for carving, for hand carving ever. 1805 was when this, when they started using shell. I mean, cameos dated back to 300 BC when they started, you know, they'd use agate, onyx, yes. lava, um, coral were other mediums turquoise. that used. Turquoise was another yes, medium. And, and one of the things clearly with that, it was, it was much harder work to, because of the harder, harder gemstone, the then they started mm -hmm. using the shell. And it's a conch shell that they use. They use what's called the cap, the outer area of the, of the shell. Where it curves. It's Where so it curves. hard right. to even try to cut out that cup. So unbelievable. I do have to give you a quick update. If you're loving this ring, I have 98 remaining. Now fewer than 98. Thank you for your update, Jared. 88 now remaining, so the ring will sell out first please do not let the pendant opportunity or that beautiful brooch pendant which is five star rated by the way uh, pass you by it really is extraordinary it's about two and a half inches in the length about two inches wide uh, the chain is not included but it has such a nice bail you can pretty much slide any chain through there and just have that Holy smokes, fireworks on your Do neck. yourself a favor. You've got a 30-day money-back guarantee on both. Get both. Do flex pays on both. Have them both sent to you and make that decision at home. But don't think I'll just get the brooch and get it home and go, oh, I've got to get the ring as well because the ring's going to be gone. As yep. we've got now fewer than 75 remaining in the ring. So please, please, if you can, oh, get the size of the ring, get the brooch, in. get them both home. And if you choose, you may choose, you may say, okay, what? I'll return the, the brooch, whatever you choose to do. But that is there and an option that you should definitely take advantage of. Take a look next. If you're looking...